Hello! And welcome back to episode number 13 of our Pokemon Prism Nuzlocke. I am Master Fish Plus, your resident Poke Master. And on the last episode, we played a dangerous, dangerous game. Holy cow, I thought we were going to lose somebody. We fought a Gyarados, fought a Pidgeotto, we fought a really, really tough Weeping Bell. But we came out on top somehow, and then we kind of just proceeded through the game. We had to go get Professor Ilk to let us get past a guard who said there were earthquakes, and now we're going to go to the catacombs, I guess. So it's anyone's anyone's guess what's going on. I'm in the daycare park right now, and it is Sunday, November 13th at 6.03 a.m. Prime recording time, I guess. Let's do a team recap. Team got way out of whack thanks to that stupid game. We have Pika Blue over here at level 30. Uh, Confuse Guard, which we still don't really have proof that it works on Confusion or if it's single use or what. Double Slap, Bubble Beam, Future Sight, and saying, hoping that, you know, Pika Blue learns Play Rough or Waterfall or something here. This moveset's getting a little bit stale. Huge Power is the ability. I'll prove it to you. See? Huge Power. I knew it. Pudgy the Pidgeotto, level 26, needs to get some levels now. Wing Attack, Razor Leaf, Quick Attack, Fly, Keen Eye is our ability. Final the Quilava, level 26 as well. Flame Wheel, Will-O-Wisp, Swift and Quick Attack. Blaze is the ability. Reptar the Pupitar, Soft Sand, Holden, Rock Throw, Bite, Dig, Sandstorm, Noen with Shed Skin as an ability. That hasn't come in handy for us yet, but it will. It will. Captain the Flaffy, probably the one we really need to get level 30 next because she will evolve. Spark, Light, Screen, Thunder, Shock, and Tackle. Static is the ability, great ability. Last but not least, last but not least, I think it's last, Dr. Timmy the Haunter, newest member of our team. Laughing Gas, Icy Wind, Dark Pulse from TM, which we got last episode. We beat the Gym Leader, and Hypnosis, Levitate is the ability that, though it's not doing a whole bunch for us, because we're not Poison type anymore. All right, well, let's switch Captain up front, like I said. Pretty sure we're good on everything, so let's uh, let's go past the daycare dude and the daycare chick and fight Green Hat. I just caught three Pokemon. Now time to make them fight. Is that gonna be your whole team? How'd you do it? How did you do it? How did you walk into the grass, catch three Mons, and immediately reach my level? You, level 27 Weaving Bell. Like, really? Really, how? You're not allowed to do this. There's no way they listen to you. I don't understand. I do not understand. Ah, I can't even take this weeping Bell in one shot. Now we're getting sludged again. Sludge is a sleeper move, man. Like, look at that. Look at that damage. Why is Sludge hitting so hard? Is it upped in power in this game or something? I don't know. I do not know. We got Manectric next. Well, I need to get out of here. Uh, Reptar can deal with Manectric unless Manectric has uh, Mega Drain. That would suck. That would suck for no good reason. He's got Bite. Don't flinch me. Don't flinch me, dude. Well, that's not good. Hopefully this kills him. That's Soft Sand Boosted Dig from... From, uh... Reptar, this should take him out. Yeah, okay. It's it's strong enough. Reptar is not weak. No, sir. These mons are getting a little a little scary, huh? I mean, Power Ballad Manectric, that did a lot of damage. We are not learning Ancient Power. That is not gonna happen. That is a special move. And we got Vulpix as the last mon out here. Um, I don't wanna switch to Pika Blue. But I guess we'll switch to Captain. I mean, Captain needs the EXP, and this isn't necessarily something Captain can't do. <sighs> Send headbutt. It's not playing, dude. Come on, Captain. You got this. Ooh. Fire spin. Well, we're not going anywhere. Uh, we should. We're not in trouble. But we need to kind of uh, make some moves here. We are we're in chip damage city. Guess I'll guess I'll super potion. Running low on those, I see. 
Oh, feels... Oh, shoot. Between episodes, I gotta do the freaking rings. I know. It's like we're running low on money. Well, the game's given you every opportunity to become rich. It's your fault for not doing it. You have the tools. Great. Please, I need you to actually, uh... This is brutal. I don't have any better healing item either, do I? I have a hyper potion. Um, I'm gonna just kind of risk it and not do that now. The day of freaking Vulpix puts us through our paces, dude. Like, who's gonna win in a fight? An electric, a very large electric lamb. Or a small fiery fox. My money's on the lamb. Simply because I know. I don't believe this, Captain. I gotta. I, I'm not. I, I gotta get you out. You. You hurt yourself in confusion. What? Four times? You gotta be joking me, man. You gotta be kidding me. This Zen headbutt and Vulpix is just running our team down. It's brutal. I just wanted her to use Spark. It's all I wanted. It's not even that much EXP. Holy crap. Well, that was the first six minutes of the episode. And now we gotta go heal. And I gotta get some dang money. Good lord. We can grab a berry off this tree, can't we? Yeah, okay. Double Lepa Berry. That's good. That's, that's, that's worth it. Holy lord, dude. Uh, we gotta... What else do we gotta do? We gotta search the route for gold tokens. Because we need a trade stone. And I can't remember how many tokens it is for a trade stone, but... It's more than one, and less than ten. So there. Uh, I grabbed every single token off of the routes and towns previous to here. Did that between episodes. I don't... Did we get the one on this route? I, I should just... I should just turn this on every once in a while while we go through. Um, what's the... What's the encounter? We don't get an encounter. What is it? It's a bunny area. I had one, so it was fine. Go, Captain. This is gonna level you up this will. Encore. Can you use Confuse Ray and um, Protect and Attract on Captain, please? Um, that is what I need right now because I'm enjoying the game and I need to not. This game has taught me that you get to question whether or not you even get to attack this turn. Have fun, nerd. Thunder Wave! Oh, yes! I believe we're gonna take Thunder Wave. Yeah, I don't need Tackle. I mean, that was our one move that was an electric type, but... Hey, Thunder Wave, guys. I... Oh, hello again. I heard everything from Professor Ilk. Good luck to you. Okay. Wow, okay, I didn't even move. Oh, it's Electrike! We're running. We're not fighting this dude. He's too green. He's too green for me. I don't fight things that green. Alright. Today's gonna be a slow episode. We're not really gonna get anything done. I'm gonna be running around in this grass encountering things every time I turn around. That is what will happen. <laughs> Uncanny! This is the, the most constant encounters I've gotten in a while. Really, really making me want to use a repel, but we don't have the money. We don't have the money for that. We, we really, really don't. I'm going to make a note, and between episodes, I will do the grind. I will do the grinding. Yeah, I bet you guys are like, what is he doing? Why is he doing that on Aeron? You're a Steel Eater. Is that gonna hurt? It looks like a special move. Yeah. Um, Steel Eater works. At, no, it's a. I think it's a poison move that's super effective against Steel. Strangely. Um... I don't know about this one. I'm gonna switch. It's one thing to put him in. 
put Captain in against. Technically, Dr. Timmy resists ground, but has... Technically, Dr. Timmy, if he used a special move... But then Dr. Timmy doesn't know anything anyway. That's gonna hurt him anyway. I'm gonna switch to Pika Blue. Even though this is kind of a dumb option. He could go Iron Head. He uses a Steel Eater. Well, that's poison! I'm pretty sure it's gonna find out right now. Yeah, it is poison. Does a lot of damage. Um, I'm not especially worried, although a crit will almost kill us, I believe, because that did 40, that did 50 damage. Alright, well, if he's gonna use a poison move again, I'm gonna go Reptar. Reptar's gonna resist it. He goes Power Ballad. Well, that sucks. Why does your Laron know Power Ballad? This Laron's just inundated with special moves, man. If he goes Earthquake, he goes Power Ballad. He's trying to stack that attack. Why does Laron get Power Ballad? That's what I want to know. Wow! Wow! That's a lot of damage! I guess it's four times, but still, that's a Laron. He's got some defense. If anything's gonna live a four time... Are you kidding me, man? I'm getting just goofed up! I'm getting goofed in this episode! Everything is exactly where it needs to be for me to succeed, and I just refuse to do it! I refuse to succeed. This lady te this lady has green lipstick on. You see that? Technically, there's green where her mouth should be. Therefore, under yeah, look, see, she's got green lipstick. Underneath the cave, there used to be a town, so it makes sense that there's a Pokemon Center. I mean, we've already gone to towns where they were like, "I refuse to use the Pokemon Center. I'm gonna fight Goblin." Crap! I wanted to have a freaking Ampharos, and now I. Ahem. <clears throat> Oh look, it's the little kid who just won't quit. Your persistence is nothing but a nuisance to all Nalho residents. I'm bloody tired of this little goody two-shoes trying to hinder my big ambitions again. What are they? Your Pokemon better know how to fight by now. They did, and they did the previous two times, Goblin. If you want to badmouth me, at least be right. He's got a Parasect. <laughs> Got a pair of sec? Well, I got a pair of fists. Uh, I'm gonna punch your zombie crab. Fury Cutter, I don't like that. That's gonna get really ugly really fast. We better hit him with a times four move. <laughs> oh, get him, final. He's gonna have to crit on the, nope. <laughs> He's, he'd have to crit on the next one. <laughs> he wouldn't kill us. Captain's level 30. Come on, evolve in battle. I think I played one fan game ever where they would evolve mid-battle. Ooh, I don't like Scyther. We can cut his attack with Will-O-Wisp. I wonder if that's a better move. Wing attack is about to come in and absolutely... Uh... I really, really want to cut his attack. But I am fairly certain... Defense 44. Who has attack comparable to what Scyther might have? He could have, he could have like a hundred attack, because Pika Blue has a hundred. Pika Blue is only a little stronger, and this is a Scyther who has real high base attack. And he's two levels above us. I don't. I really, really, really don't want it to go down like that. But if he starts clicking Fury Cutter and we can't land Rock Throw, I'm gonna really wish we'd have burned him. I'm gonna go to Reptar because I'm in. He, Reptar will resist all of his moves and I'm not sure Final's gonna take a stab wing attack from Scyther two levels up. I've had issues with this before. I've had issues with. Yup. With stupid strong, look how much damage that did to Reptar. My point proven. Um, rather, oh gosh. I hope this hurts. Oh my gosh, Reptar, king of the rocks. Oh my lord, Reptar, coming in absolutely clutch. 
That's how winning is done. Sneasel, you got nothing anymore. Let me hard counter your Sneasel. Oh my lord, Reptar. Coming in to do the job. You need work done, call Reptar. I'm gonna slap this Sneasel into another dimension. Oh ho ho ho! I slapped the snot out his nose, man. He'll never be the same, and neither will Shelgon over here. You're gonna catch some hands, my guy. Oh ho ho ho! Dealing with the Salamence is gonna be hard, but until then. <laughs> Dude, what the heck? <laughs> Game shark freaking Pupitar over here. What are you doing? Captain's evolving. I needed this for the fight, dude. Oh, baby, I'm glad he lived. <laughs> I need Intimidate on my team. I gotta get Intimidate. I gotta get Chance out here soon. Look, I do what I gotta do, okay? A guy like me doesn't need to explain himself. Just, just leave me alone. Look, I do what I gotta do. A guy like me doesn't need to explain himself. Just leave me alone. I'm blocking the door so he can't leave. Uh, I gotta heal, but that went extraordinarily well. Um, Reptar, King of the Rocks over here. It's not even a good name, man. But that's what he did. I was really worried for good reason. I would have had to switch. I'm not losing Reptar. But... If... If that hadn't have worked, no one on my team has higher defense than Reptar does, right? Reptar's defense is 57. And that Fury Cutter was about to take him out on the next one. So we would have had to sack somebody. And it probably would have been... Probably would have been Pudgy. Because I have no... And then I would have had to go Captain. Or or Final or something. And he would have still been clicking it. So he would have run through our whole team with that Scyther. And there would have been nothing I could do. We would have... We had a, that would have been bad if there wasn't a crit there. I don't know if we could have done it. I can, I can hazard that me... <sighs> Scyther's so fast. Scissor isn't fast. Scyther's freaking fast but and he's got such great attack and he's just it's always been strangely bulky really pikachu's in here already caught one of those so we got a different encounter but that was that was very worrying very very worrying uh captain i noticed did not learn thunder punch he's got great special attack though all he knows is thunder shock can we get like dark pulse on him i need a i need a special move on captain Put Swift on him. Before I do that, though, can we get can we get Dark Pulse? I don't know why we would. Yeah, he's not able to. Uh, try attack, because Spark is great and all, but we really, really need to be leaning into his better stats around now. He knows Spark, Thunder Shock, Light Screen. I'm not getting rid of Light Screen. I really, really don't want to get rid of Spark. But Thundershock Swift is probably going to be better for us. Because we need that. It, we need access to the 87 special attack. We need it. So Thundershock's just going to have to pull its weight for now. Until we get Thunderbolt or Discharge. And Swift will help him ignore accuracy on Mons that want to screw with us. Not my favorite play right there, but... I, I think it's what we got to do. Because Spark is not going to be worth it. Well, it is worth it, but we need some variance on... on captain here. Who's next? Who really needs to get up in level next? Uh, Final. Final is in the same boat as captain. He needs a special move. I believe Final's special attack is better. So we gotta get Flamethrower on him. Oh, is, our, is this our encounter? Yeah, we haven't gotten a Geodude yet. Well, that's pretty cool. Uh, who hurts him? Peekaboo does. Peekaboo can put him to sleep and then... I don't want to double. Ooh. Ooh. It's gonna do nothing, but that's still bothersome. Oh, 
yeah, like, our team is good. It's just not at full strength yet. And having things come down to peekaboo right now. I'm gonna try to catch this guy at full health, otherwise I gotta click future sight. Yeah. Sweet. Um, what do I name my male golem? I know I go Terra for female. Eh, you can go either way with Terra. You got you got Terra in Kingdom Hearts. Proud of their sturdy bodies, they bash against each other in a contest to prove whose is harder. There's your nickname right there. Hard body. Hard body the Geo dude. He's just arms. <laughs> he skips leg day cuz he doesn't have any. <laughs> there you go. All right. Oh shoot. I've made a mistake. So, boss, when are we going to get paid for this? Number 13. You'll get paid when you do your job. But we have been doing our job properly. Oh yeah, Missy? Then tell me about this. Why are the cops suspecting that something fishy's going on in the underground city? Hmm? It probably has something to do with all of those big, weird earthquakes. Missy. Wait. Dude. You're a girl? Oh! <laughs> the implication is that they can't hear each other. They have to read each other's text. And for whatever reason, the scientists knew Yellow was a girl. And now Green's like, wait, you're a girl? Of course I am. We went to high school together, remember? I don't remember our high school allowing girls at campus. Yeah, they let me in anyway. Have a problem with that, huh? I don't know what that means. <laughs> Is this what you guys call doing your job? I can't believe the boss hired these guys. Could you guys just please shut up and do your darn job? No cops! Got it. Got it. But the cops aren't whom you should be worried about. There's some kid from a distant region who keeps getting in our way. Naturally, no matter what we do, we'll end up facing that um, annoyance again. It's like our fate, I guess. Totally. Mm, well, if that's the case, I'll just let the boss know about this prodigy. But we'll take care of him. Don't worry about it. Anyway, you three, let your boss know you're going with these distractions. We're really close to finishing our project, at least. I had to use five voices here. That was some pretty cool banter we had going on there. Yeah, but don't you know my gender? I thought we were together for ages. Wait, what? What? Why do you think that? <laughs> Hang on. It's sometimes hard to hear with this helmet. <laughs> Poor Green. <laughs> it's like, what? You're a girl? Wait, what? We've been together? <laughs> Why are you mad? I didn't know! <laughs> oh, man. You don't get paid enough for this. Uh, okay, hey, dude. I <laughs> this game's great, man. I love this game. And this guy loves lemonade! If you get me a glass of lemonade, I'll give you a neat artifact. So what do you say? Will you give me one? You can't fool me! You don't have a single glass of lemonade! Yeah, I just have it sitting in my bag, dude. I put it in there, just... <laughs> Gliger! Oh, I would've loved a Gliger. Aw, oh, man. I have no medicine left, either. If we get in a tough fight, I'm gonna die, guys. That's gonna be it. Hey, we have a gold token. Look at that. I didn't know that. Okay. I, I don't know what else is going to happen in here. If I see a... Ah, oh, shoot! I was just going to say, if I see this guy, I'm going to turn around and go buy medicine. Seriously? 
crap. I'm gonna get us killed. It's four mons. He starts with Electabuzz. Okay. All right. That's a really high level Electabuzz. The good news is Electabuzz is gonna lead with Screech. That's perfect. That is perfect because that already indicates he's gonna be a physical attacker and I just blew his attack stat. Who's resisting everything Electabuzz can do? Not necessarily, Captain, but if he's gonna go Thunder Punch, yep. And guess who just learned Swift to take care of all of our... <sighs> yep, I misclicked that badly. I talked about using Swift, I taught him Swift, and I clicked Thundershock. He is really trying to... <laughs> He's really trying to get that attack stat back, dude. I got bad news. Ow. He could still bop us. He could still give us a little flick on the nose. I'm just gonna go light screen this turn. He's gonna miss. I'm gonna get the light screen. And he's gonna be gone. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. So Palette Patrol Yellow has uh, yellow Pokemon. I cannot remember what else he had. He had Pikachu? He's got a Hariyama. Well, we are also still kind of in bad shape to deal with Hariyama, but I do believe Pika Blue is just going to pull Hariyama into pieces. Oh. Wow. Yeah, Hariyama's not... not going to do very well against Critical Hit. And you lose the belly drum! You're trying to threaten me. Can't use belly drum if you're below half HP. For anyone wondering why it didn't work. I'm, I'm the kind of guy who would stupidly like be like, Wait, why didn't belly drum work? And I, you know, I wouldn't think. I should know that. I feel like in the past I've made those mistakes stupidly. Oh yeah, this is the one... <laughs> So, 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 so busted that you have three growths! This better one shot. Okay. Dude uses growth three times! That's so, so disgusting. This is not. I mean, I. Mm, I don't know if I can give you the yellow on this one. That is a heavy double kick. I feel like I'm dealing with... I don't remember EV training specifics for second gen, but I'm pretty sure I'm dealing with mons of that caliber. And this should one-shot Quilava. Yeah, Reptar's dig is not to be trifled with. Reptar's dig is all around nasty. Hey, come on now! Look, I'm having a real bad day. I don't want to talk to you. I, I like the pallet patrollers. I feel I feel bad for for her and Green. I I feel bad for them both. Green had no idea what was going on, and Yellow just learned that reality wasn't what she thought it was. Um. All right. Well, do I grind? I kind of got to grind the team to thirty, don't I? Oh, hey, it's finally morning. Man, that's great. Normally when I record on days like these, it's always nighttime. Do I go to- I should probably take the whole team and make sure they're 30. Especially with what kind of crap we've been dealing with, huh? I mean, what is our lowest level? We still have Dr. Timmy at 26. Yeah, I'm gonna round the team off between episodes. And I'm gonna try to... Bear with me, I'm gonna try to make some money. I- I don't know how much do we have. Do we have enough to even start? Got 8,000 bucks. I'm gonna try to turn that into a million. I'm not doing a million. I, guys, I, I, I was joking. I'm not not. <sighs> so... Um, we gotta... We gotta go get a whole bunch of mining picks. Well, I guess I can do some of it now, huh? I mean, you guys might want to see the beginning. Who knows? Might be fun. So we gotta go to where you buy mining picks. You buy mining picks in Heath Village. They're 500 bucks a pop. And then what we do is, I don't know if there's places that are better. I'm just going to buy 17. Just screw it. We have that nugget. If we really need potions, we can go use that. But I'm hoping 17, 17 of these will, like, get us somewhere. 
And then I like to... I like to mine in Mountain Cave. Actually, should we go to... Should we go do our mining in Milos Catacombs? Can't fly there. Alright, well then, for now, no. Nah, we're good. Uh... So, we gotta go into the cave. And... Blow all of our mining picks, so let's do it. I'll do it with you guys. We'll be right here. So we're level two miners. I don't know if that's better or worse. Gold dust, so... I gotta talk to the guy and figure out what gold dust does. I really don't wanna use a repel. I mean, technically we don't have to move, so... More gold dust. Just staying in one spot, give us the same... Okay, hello, Firestone. I really need some, like, copper or something. I really need something that isn't gold dust here, man. King's Rock. Well, hello! Talk about money! Um, if we have King's Rock and we give it to Peekaboo, who only uses Double Slap, we have a Mon who... I'm giving this to Captain. Captain got crossed over by confusion. Uh, anyway, doubles... I believe King's Rock increases the proc chance if you have moves that hit multiple times. I'm not sure if it's significant, but one of the strategies, you get something with skill. Oh, I gotta mine rocks. Okay. You get something with skill link, so you hit every time, and then you put, like, King's Rock on it, and you just screw people up. Are we supposed to be able to get, like, medals? Yeah, ore. There you go. Another Everstone. I guess we can sell some of this for money. I mean... Unable to extract. Uh, is that gonna continue? I just blew a thousand dollars. Yay, we're level four. I think we're max level. Aren't we? I wonder if that lowers our... Okay, I was gonna say. Does that lower our, our, our fail-to-extract level? Okay, we're level four. Two out of eight. Oh. Oh, we need eight to level up again. I gotcha. Okay. Well, we're gonna go... Come along with me, guys. You... I... I'm learning this, so we may as well just do it together, huh? A little bit extra time. For any of you who don't want to watch me mine, I guess, see you next time. Thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for playing. And for what? Uh, farewell. Uh, there you go. That's my, that's my end card. <laughs> uh, so... Bell Sprout. I should really use Repel. But, like, I just spent all my money, so... I'm not gonna... I'm gonna go down and around the lake, past the girls, into this building, down the stairs, through Grey Cave, and I think this guy, uh, ha! Lava may seem useless, but to me it's a moneymaker. Interact with the lava to smelt whatever ore you may have mined or turn your coal into ash. Just make sure you have your sit sack before you put your coal in there. Oh, and you need an ore case to throw your ores. Okay, so I gotta get the suit. All of our ore. I've got iron ore, and the iron ore was put in the ore case. And now I have 14 ash. Okay. You wish to sell me some ores. All your ores sum up to a total of $200. Yeah, I'll sell all the ore. Okay, so that was nothing. We, we netted nothing for money right there, but that's okay. Now we just need to go and fly. I can't fly out of here. Are you joking? I have dig. Dig me out. Hey. Nothing can stop us. We cannot be contained. Okay. So now we have to go to Terenia and go south. And then I'll do this and then that's the end of the episode and I'll go figure out the rest of it. Or I'll, I'll replicate the strategy as it were. Unless, of course, this is just the end of our money, and I blew all our cash on something with no return. 
Welcome, welcome. I can make a ring if you have the necessary materials. Which ring do you want to make? I think I can make a fire ring. I must be level 4 in order to make it. You need 25 grams of ash to make this ring. Ah! Uh... <laughs> Alright, well, I guess that's the end of the episode. I'll try to work something out. I have some resources. I can sell some stuff, get some mining picks. I'll see if I can consolidate our funds and make something happen, and I'll grind the team up. So, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, please like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. It really helps out the channel. Thanks for playing. But for now, my friends, farewell.